Harrison. Now the Sox tonight are on their way home and Jet Jackson is standing by the Colorado Springs Municipal Airport and soon as they come in, we'll go out live to Jet at the airport. As the pennant races continue, Jackson, he's standing by with the Colorado Springs Sky Sox. Jet. John, the Sox just stepped off the plane. A good crowd up there at the gate to cheer him on. Here with me is Mike Aldretti, a veteran Major League player, one of the keys to the Sky Sox success this year. Uh, Mike, it's only a AAA title, but how does it feel? Well, it's actually my first title uh, of any kind, so it feels real good. Uh, AAA, uh, big leagues, uh, minor leagues, it's all, I mean, it feels great. Uh, second half, you guys are on fire. Nobody really came close to you, and then you sweep Vancouver. Uh, what about the second half? How come you guys were so tough? Well, I think that uh, the talent that we did have, it kind of started gelling towards the second half. I think we had real good talent in the first half, but it took everybody a little while to get to know each other, get used to everything. And uh, like you said, in the second half, I don't think anybody could touch us. Uh, uh, previous Sky Sox team sort of been a murderer's row of uh, home run hitters. This year, a bit more balanced. Yeah, I think that uh, one thing Charlie does is he wants to have good hitting lineups. And uh, this team was no exception. However, we didn't have the big boppers in there. But I think everybody, like, uh, if you look at the playoffs, one through nine, I think everybody's got a home run in the playoffs. So uh, Charlie had everybody in there capable of hitting a home run, but he wasn't really counting on one guy all the time. Mike, as far as you go to win a PCL championship, does that raise your stock, uh, especially with expansion? I don't know if it raises my stock. I don't know if uh, if I even have a stock, but uh, uh, I'd like to think that uh, it's a feather in my cap. And uh, one thing that uh, I do know is that the teams that I have played on have uh, have all been winners. Uh, not necessarily winning the whole thing, but uh, I hopefully hopefully that means something uh, when I decide to sign a contract next year. All right, sir. So we hope to see you in the bigs. Mike Aldretti, thanks for your time. Thank you very Congratulations. much. Congratulations. So that's it. The Sox are here. As I say, there's a big crowd to greet them. This is a happy town right now. I'm Jed Jackson, live 11 Sports. Thanks a lot, Jed, and we'll have more on the Sox tomorrow at 5.30. You know, after fame, we were very fortunate that we took them in three, but at the same time, to me, I had the better team. He sure did. Hey, your future, real quickly, uh, a lot of talk, maybe the Rockies, what do you think? I don't know. I haven't seen, in, in our business, you know, like I haven't talked to no one yet, and I can't tell that my contract runs out with the Cleveland Indians. But I am, I will be looking around, and I do want to further my career. You know, like, as, like I said before, my goal is to get to the major leagues. But that still doesn't mean that, that I want manage the Sky Sox. Sure. Hey, congratulations. That's great, Coach. Thank you, Guy. Thank you very much. Charlie Emanuel, the winning manager, PCL champions. This is the first time in five years, thanks, Coach, that they have won. They did win. The old Sox won way back in 1958 in the old Western League, but this is the first PCL champions. This is great. We'll stay here, get some more interviews, and bring you a full report tomorrow at 5.30. For now, Guy Gurton live inside the terminal out at the airport for Eyewitness Sports. Back to you. All right, Guy, thank you. Pass along our congratulations to everybody involved. Okay, let's move on to the big